Are you lacking in patience? Well, I sure am. The word itself, the word patience, comes from a Latin word, patior, which means to suffer. The dictionary says patience is the bearing of a provocation, annoyance, misfortune, or pain without complaint, loss of temper, irritation, or the like. <laughs> I don't know about you, but I have a long way to go to master patience. Even when I pray, I sometimes look for quick answers to my prayers. And I have to remember that God's timeline and my wishes don't always coincide. And that's one of the reasons why today's feast day is so important for us. No, I'm not talking about Groundhog Day, but I'm talking about the Feast of the Presentation of the Lord. Forty days ago was Christmas, and according to the Law of Moses, on the fortieth day after the birth, the firstborn male was to be taken to the temple, when in a ceremony was formally presented and consecrated to the Lord. In the Gospel today, we have two older people, Simeon and Anna, who are in the temple every day, patiently waiting to see the Messiah. These two folks have a lot to teach us about being patient in prayer. Now, both of them all their life had been looking forward to the time when God would send his anointed one to make things all right. But in reading today's passage, I don't get the idea that they were frustrated or impatient in their waiting. Instead, Luke tells us, that Simeon was a righteous and devout man. He was steadfast in his hope for the coming of the Christ. Anna had devoted her life to prayer and fasting in the temple in her expectation of the Messiah's coming. For years and years they prayed and waited and hoped, and they didn't allow their own personal agendas to distract them from their ongoing vigil. So imagine the sense of peace and trust in the Lord they had. Imagine if we had that same peace and trust. When we pray, let's trust God. I think we'd be more open to accepting God's plan for our lives instead of trying to push our own agendas. Today, let's present ourselves to the Lord. And like Simeon and Anna, Wait patiently for God, who in his own good time will reveal himself to us. May Almighty God bless and keep you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Have a patient Tuesday.